first and foremost, it was alignment to those core values and commitments that we have and that we we articulate to our community. That was first and foremost. But but secondly, there was a commitment to customer service and there was a commitment to relationships. And we're, we're a small district. And once again, you, you hear me kind of harp on it because I, I believe it's just fundamental for leaders to make decisions based on their core values. Relationships is our number one core value. We are a highly relational culture. So we wanted a partnership where we were going to have a deep relationship. We were going to have people we could call, people we knew by first name, people who were felt were a part of the pirate family, uh, not an external vendor in a call center, you know, but people like yourself that we've had relationships with over the years, that there was that friendship, there was that relationship that exists. Uh, that was really important to us because we are a highly relational culture. It is one of our core values. And, and so the commitment to customer service and building a deep and lasting relationship that came through at the very beginning, and and since day one, that that continues uh, to to be the trend. Now, of course, you know, with with all things with technology, not every day is perfect. Not everything is 100% foolproof, right. but right. but the nothing is. And and right. the idea that the relationship exists, that we can have the conversations and have frank and candid conversations and articulate our needs, and to have people on the other end that have empathy for what our school level leaders are going through and respond in an extremely fast fashion. Uh, you know, that, that, that's what relationships are about. And, and so it, once again, it, it aligns uh, so clearly with our core values and this partnership uh, meets that core value of relationships. Mm -hmm.